What's up guys, Zinigami here. Let's go through 30 Salmon on Waffle Island. This, the condition for this island is that you can only bring shooter or ambition type characters to this island. And we're going to be using a shooter team. We can use a, an ace friend, we might as well, since they are super cool. And as we're, we'll be using a free to play shooter team. Ayn is nice because uh, Waffle on stage 4 will silence our captains. And Golden Pound Usopp is always nice because he's Golden Pound Usopp. Dex characters are quite nice on this island because Waffle is a quick character on stage 5. And uh, on this island, you can actually, there are a bunch of little mini stages that you can get. Uh, you can get pretty much all, this, all the characters from uh, Drum Island. You can get Chess, you can get Mario, uh, Marim, Marimo, the other half of Chess. You can get Dr. Chopper's mom. You can get Dalton, you can get uh, a Snowy Chopper too. And a secret stage for this is is Snowy Chopper. All these stages will just be trying to stall out nice and slow as always. Take the hit from Turtle, don't matter. Thanks Turtle. And you definitely don't need Ace or anyone. This this island isn't that difficult. The hardest thing about this island is probably uh, getting through the three turns of silence from Wapple. But it's not that bad. We'll be able to handle that, no problemo. Da -da. Ba -ba -da -da. Baby Turtle hits us. Baby Turtle will die. Bye, Baby Turtle. It was a pleasure having you here. I remember a secret stage can show up on any stage on any difficulty. It's just that the higher difficulty, the greater chance of getting a secret stage, which is Snowy Chopper. Uh, Snow, uh, what Snowy Chopper does is Snowy Chopper will attack you for 2.1k damage, and under 20%, he uh, gives himself the greatly reduces damage over 5,000 damage effect for like nine turns. So any hits over nine over five thousand damage just get their gets the damage greatly reduced, like ninety nine percent reduction in any hits over five thousand. So it's not he's not hard. Most secret stages aren't. You just want to be careful and uh, try to avoid the below twenty percent, just because it takes up a lot more time. Buku, buku. And you definitely don't need any specials for this island. This island, it just like any type reduction islands or any type restricted islands, the hardest part is just finding a team that works for you. Uh, most people are just gonna be too busy trying to find like five of their best shooters or five of their best ambition type characters that work well together, and that's gonna be more important. Than, and the levels that you have in those characters is gonna be more important than the actual levels that characters that you bring themselves. So here we go, we got Wapple and Robson. Wapple will preemptively attack for 3,000 and uh, blind us for 3 turns, or 2 turns. Um, under 50%, uh, Wapple will uh, uh, silence both of our captains for 3 turns, which is what we have Ein for. And here you just want to be used to hitting your perfects. Boom. Great. That's a shame. Be better than that. That's actually the first time I think I've ever attacked with Duval. Let's see if I can push him under 20% so I can get the silence now. And uh, what Robson will do is Robson will attack us for 4,200 damage. And under 50%, Robson will boost. Attack and defense for five turns, so you can just leave Robson alone. He has a really long attack cooldown, so he's not too much of a threat. And here we'll lose extra health we get from Ace, anyways. Ein gets rid of our silence, so we can actually do things again. Now I can spend some time looking for some food orbs and heal up. 
So it's not that bad. Pretty easy. You can always use uh, you always can use ambition teams. I will have a walkthrough video with ambition teams right after this video too. Boop. I'm gonna try to avoid getting him under 50%. So that way he doesn't boost his stats up yet. Now that he's uh, now he's on a two-turn cooldown, I'm just gonna push him low so I can spend some time trying to heal, and then we'll kill him next turn. The attack and defense uh, attack and defense boost from Robson isn't that large. You can kill him within that turn. It's just a small defense boost. Any blue defense boost is just a flat defense boost, and usually are just not very not very concerning at all. The real defense boosts that are really hard to deal with are the rainbow colored ones because that is a percent health defense boost. Anyways, on to Wobble number two. Wobble number two will preemptively boost his defense. Bum 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 bum. There you go. Boost his defense. And under 50%, he'll shuffle these three orbs and lock them. And he'll give you combo like tandem orbs, bomb orbs, or bother orbs in these three slots and lock it for one turn. Under 20%, he'll lock these three slots for one turn. Shuffle and lock these three slots for one turn. So what we can do here is... Oh my goodness. Looks like Droid Frex crashed on me. Alright, we're back. You didn't see anything. Nothing happened. We're gonna start using Duval. He cuts health by 20%. He's basically our mini Mihawk here. Beautiful. Beautifully done. And... We can just use everything. It's not too dangerous. Cuts our health. Does damage based on how much we, health we lost. Pachoo! Locks our orbs. Zephyr boost. It's nice locking our orbs when we get our matching dex orbs. But I don't have a... Uh, I don't have a... Orb booster. So it's just going to be a tight booster for me today. And now we hit him. Hit him with our best shot. And if you just use Golem Hound Usam on Wobble, super easy. There's nothing really that Wobble does. Remember that if he if he does attack, what he'll do is he'll shuffle under 50%, he'll shuffle these three orbs. And under 20%, he'll shuffle these three orbs. And he'll lock them for one turn. That's it. That's Wobble. Not very hard. The more important thing is just bringing good characters that you have. You want to bring high level characters over le characters that you have that might be only level 20. So try to bring those high level characters you have leveled up. And Ayn is quite nice too, just so that we don't have to spend time on Wobble Stage 4. Wobble Stage 4 will be the hardest stage, just because of that silence. Uh, the new characters, let's actually talk about what they do. We have Robson here. Or, yeah, Robson. And what Robson does is Robson is not really great. He doesn't have a captain ability, and his special is uh, after you, if you use it and you hit all your perfects for that turn, next turn your fighters get 1.2 times attack boost for three turns. So if you hit all your perfects, fighters get 1.2 times attack for three turns. And Wapple himself, he starts out as a strength character actually, and then you evolve him and he becomes a quick character. It's not really, you don't really need to leave him unevolved, you might as well evolve him. Uh, his captain ability is boost ambition type characters by two times attack, and his special is deals twenty times his attack in uh, neutral damage to one enemy and lock all your orbs one turn. That's not that's not exact damage. That is neutral damage, so it's just not it's not quick damage. It's not strength damage. It's just twenty times his attack in damage and locks your orbs one turn, which is okay. It's not the greatest. His stats seem to be pretty okay too. Uh, but he's a decent ambition character. Uh, uh, new Chopper. Let me pull up New Chopper here. I've got him somewhere. Chopper, chopper, chopper. Chopper, chopper, chopper. Chopper! More Snow Chopper. I love this Chopper. It's just, the Chopper is just so freaking cute. Oh my goodness. New Chopper! Chopper. He boosts attack of dex characters by 1.5. Reduces damage taken by 10%. Not useful captain ability. His special is Smoker special, reduces damage taken by 50% for 3 turns, and gives a small boost to dex orbs for 3 turns. 
Um, I haven't managed to test out the orb boost yet, but it's probably maybe a 20% orb boost. It's not really that great. Um, oh, look, there. Oh, no, that's, Cap that's Captain Billy. Huh. Um, but it's a small orb boost for three turns as well, so reduce your damage taken, small orb boost. His stats are pretty abysmal, though. Starts out super, super small. Uh, we'll see. I don't, I don't, we're not sure what his stats max out on, but he's a decent smoker replacement if you don't have smoker. The cooldown is super long, though. You can get his books on this island, but the cooldown is just not as, not as good as smoker. But, I mean, it's Chopper. He's just super cute. And that's it for the new characters on this island. Uh, just just for funsies, we'll go over to the, the Christmas Law and Christmas Bonnie that are out now, too. Uh, Christmas Bonnie boosts your attack and recovery of Psy by two times, and she'll swap orbs around her to food orbs and boost recovery of Psy characters by 1.5 for one turn. And Christmas Law, uh, his captain ability is boost slash or attack by 2.5, so he's basically another Mihawk captain for you. And his special is change his orb to food orb and heals 15 times his recovery. And he's got some decent recovery, so he's going to be a really big heal. Uh, but it's, it's okay. You're probably still going to be sticking to Mihawks. Uh, you could use him on a freedom turret team, though. Maybe if you need the extra healing. Anyways, guys, that's Waffle Island. Good luck. He does give you six-star Marco skill books. I'm definitely going to be farming those for my Marco, because Marco is amazing. I've been Zigami. Thank you so much for coming out and watching this. Y'all stay beautiful.